All right, guys, I hate to make this video, but seems like the remote ID is going to be here to stay. So today we're actually going to look at a remote ID module that is manufactured from Holy Stone. They're kind enough to send me a kit just to review and do a tutorial on how this should be used. So basically just a brief introduction of how this operates is you basically it's an external module. You will be able to apply to any drone that requires a remote ID. You just take it out set it up with the app and basically put it on your drone and they start broadcast and that's how simple it is all right so let's just dive into it and let's look at how you can get this working in addition make sure to stay to the end as there is a big discount that holy stone is offering to purchase one of these modules so your cost is going to be even lower than the listed price all right first thing first we're just going to unbox it let's see what is in there okay oops so very simple you basically get your module like that it's not super big so i think if you're flying at pv drones most likely the drone you need remote id is going to be big like right so it's going to be like five inch or at least those kind of three inch cine whoops that that's generally the time that you're going to require one of those so this weight should be no problem at all okay so let's continue to look into the box i think there's going to be a manual that you will be able to see how to set everything up let's open it oh actually there are some other stuffs so obviously you're going to get a manual startup guide okay you can read it if you want but if you don't want to read it i'm going to teach you how to use it okay so this is the thing i like which is going to be those kind of velcro tapes you will be able to put it on the back the other side goes to your drone and then you can basically plug it unplug it as you see please let's put this on the back just so we can mount it somewhere later on all right let's dive into the tutorials before we begin there is one thing i need you to do which is to download the holy stone go to app you will be able to use the QR code on the screen or the link below to download. You can download it on your cell phone. Once you have downloaded the app, I want you to power on the remote ID module by long pressing the only button in the middle. And if this is the first time you are powering it up, you're going to see a solid green light on the left and a slowly blinking light that will eventually turn solid on the right. So the left side, the light basically indicates your battery. If it's solid, it means that your battery is full. If it's blinking, it means you probably have to charge it. You're gonna have to charge it with the USB-C cable here. On the right side, the rapid blinking light is going to indicate that this remote ID module is setting up itself. And then when it goes to solid, it means that you will be able to connect this to your cell phone to set it up. So further setup is required. Let's go to our phone so we can see the setup process. All right, so with the remote ID powered on with two solid lights, I want you to go into the Holy Stone Go To app. And when you're in it, there's only one plus sign that you can press. You're just going to press the plus sign. And it's going to automatically find your device, which is the numbers. You're going to give the, you're going to tap on the numbers and you will bring into the setup page. Okay, so remote ID serial number. Okay. This is the first requirement. If you're not in EU, the operation ID is not going to be needed. And the aircraft model, for me, since these are all Holy, drone, Holy Stone drones, I'm just going to select other aircraft and you're going to manually input FPV. You can put whatever that is same as the one on your, on your registration on the FPV drone. So the weight, I'm just going to put whatever right now. It's 256 grams. And the USA class is going to be determined directly. And you're, after this, you're just going to hit save. Okay. So basically what you're going to do right now is you're going to hit confirm. Once the setup has been complete, you're going to power off your remote ID module. And then you're going to power up again. Okay. So instead of going into a solid green, you can see that this light is going to be below glowing like steadily slow this is an indication that this remote id is now broadcasting remote id to whatever app that is going out just to be a little bit discreet and for less people to know which app that this thing actually works on i'm not going to teach on this channel of where people should go to like go to the app to check on the broadcasting module so as long it is broadcasting you are compliant so you don't need to necessarily know where you're actually going the less people know the better 
All right, so that's about it for this Holy Stone Remote ID tutorial. I don't think there's much I need to say about it. You basically just powered it on, set it up in the app, and slap it onto your drone, and right now you are Remote ID compliant. Next, let's talk about the surprise. I was able to get Holy Stone to offer you guys an additional 20% off discount from the original price. The details are going to be listed at the description below, so you will be able to go check it out. That's about it for this video, and if you have additional questions, or if you wanted to let me know if you are going to comply with the remote ID or not, please leave it at the comment section because I will be really thrilled to hear what you actually think about this. However, when leaving comments, please ensure to be respectful to other people as complying or not is completely up to them. All right, so I wish you guys good flying and I'll see you in the next tutorial. Bye for now.